All right, well then, next chapter. Canadian Grand Prix, six weeks later. Hey boss, got a couple of minutes? With this being their home circuit, Straw and Latifah have been all over local media this weekend. One particular outlet appeared bent on using our recent struggles to pump up the expectations of the home drivers. They indicated that Connorsport were easy fodder for the Canadian pair. Easy fodder. This is no ultimate team, is it? There's no FIFA. Oh, we have to do another one. Devon was on a popular stream. There's channel earlier this week and promised a behind the scenes tour of our factory for next Thursday. This clash with our scheduled team building days with engineers back at the factory. No. Devon. All my homies hate Devon. Andreo! Just gone over those uh, last minute strategy changes you sent over. Okay. Yeah, I just want to make it clear, whatever happens out there today, I get pit priority, yeah? <laughs> well, we'll see how the race develops. If you need priority, you'll get it. But I can't go into the race with that on the table. Look, 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 look. We all know Jackson's not pulling his way. Now, if you want the points, I need to make sure he's not going to get in my way. Do you get me? Devon, 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 we've talked about this. Give Aiden some space. It's not about you getting in the way of each other. It's about everyone pulling together, racing as a team. Of course, of course. Yeah, so, uh, hit priority, yeah? All right, ciao. Ciao. Hi, Mike. Booking confirmation. Booked Antonio's flights out to Japan. Who the fuck is Antonio? Oh, I don't get it. We move. News? Any news? No news. Car still ass. We move. Several laps remaining. Aiden Jackson pushes on as he hopes to secure some much needed points for Connor Sports. I will win this race, homie. Just don't break down. Into turn two we go now. Butler comes out of the pit lane. Jackson is right there with him. This is dicey, Ant. Neither one of these two wants to give way. This would have been a lot cleaner if Jackson had just let him go. He's just not giving him an inch. Of course not. Fuck him. Continue onwards, still wheel to wheel. Ooh. Almost touching there as well. As we head down the straight towards the next chicane. Send it. Nothing to separate. Kill him. The car and through the chicane. Oh, they've shunted. And now Jackson sends them both off the track. And Butler over a curb. That looked nasty. And I do believe that one of their cars is damaged here, Crofty. I think it's Butler. Damage, Ant, but also they <laughs> Karma. places too. Unbelievable and totally unnecessary as well. Well, one damaged car. We love to see it. Now to make up. What a complete mess that was. We love to see it. Reclaim 13th place. For the okay, race, I'm I'll winning this race, mate. We'll what do you mean, P13? Right now, I want you to go and get those places back. Come on, let's go. Why well, am I not getting there? Do we have any damage? No damage. Oh my god. Oh. I don't want to talk about it. Just said I was gonna win this race and I've just gone straight on. Rocket ship. Oh, the chicane has changed so much. Well, the teacher was talking shit beforehand, so I'm gonna absolutely send it on him. Oh, 
a uh, good old harp and sense coming off the P14. Alright, now the objective. P13, we can win this race. Easy. F122 cars drive better on F123 than they do on F122. Uh, yeah, it is a bit slow, not gonna lie, even on a hard difficulty. Like, we're gonna make every objective easily. Overtake enabled, DRS as well. And we're gonna get DRS as well on the, on the next straight. We're gonna get big points. Still no DRS. You were talking shit about it, eh? Get out of a lobby, kid. Out of a race, but lobby. <laughs> and some oh. information on Leclerc. Okay, there. Need to overtake before the yellow. Oh my God. Master plan. First Leclerc out. Who else? Poor guy, man. Give him a break. At least on the game. Podium is on there. Maybe even a win. I don't, nah, three laps to go. Yeah, we're winning this race. Give me a challenge. Corner Sports. Greatest F1 team of all time already. I was finishing ahead of Stroll and the TT a bonus. Winning the race is a bonus, baby. 26 points coming away. Got 70% battery left. Where's Devin Butler, by the way? Oh! Third last. It's too easy. Oh, the leap. My dropper is so huge, man. Like lap time wise. I thought, ah, I can go for fastest lap, but there's no way. I don't have the grip. 
Yeah, I'm sorry, little bro, but you're gonna get dive bombed. Oh no. I my brain has not integrated that chicane yet. It's changed so much from the past F1 games. Chaos in Canada? What did I do? So it's been a day of drama here at the circuit you feel now today. Hey, drama. So much you. drama. Well, it must be the Connor Sport moment between the two drivers there. Banging wheels, not giving each other room on track. It was entertaining, of course, but definitely for all the wrong reasons. Yeah, we enjoyed it, certainly. And Aidan Jackson, well, he'd have enjoyed the result. He did well to recover. He did do well to recover, mm -hmm. but, you know, you never want to see two cars, if, if you're the team boss, seeing two cars hit each other. It's rule number one. Don't hit your teammate. Nothing ever changes. Jackson and Butler's rivalry from the past two seasons seems to be alive and well, even when they're teammates. Their unwillingness to the seat position to each other at the Canadian Grand Prix is a bad look for Connorsport. We won the race. What are you on about? The bad look. Exactly. Long bottom nose wheel. Yeah, yeah.